Hey, good morning. Thanks for uh, coming back to this. So I was on my way to the park by my house. It's this weekend before Christmas. Today's supposed to be real nice. Tomorrow's supposed to be rainy. So I wanted to get out and take some photos. On my way here, I noticed this hearse that's decorated in kind of Christmas. I, could, I think it is. There's like Christmas trees for sale here. So I saw this and then behind me, there's a tent in the woods. So I'm gonna walk around here a little bit, see what I can find. And sorry about the road noise, I'm like on the side of the road. But uh, we'll see what I can find and then I'm gonna hop over to the park to do that. Hopefully it's not busy, that's my hope. And there's like a pond there and a little pier and that's kind of what I wanted to do. I feel like uh, I'm trying to do something different than what I normally shoot and it's nice and frosty out. So we'll see what we can get. So hang on, I'm gonna show you these photos. Hopefully they're good. Should have brought the 50 instead of the 35. But it's okay, I, do, I feel like this is good for video and photos. That's why I brought that. That was like my thought process behind that. So yeah, I'm gonna hop out, show you these photos real quick. Just uh, hang, hang on, I'll be right, I'll be right back. So I just got here, this is the Oak Grove Park in Chesapeake. Um, it's right by my house. There's not that many people here, surprisingly. So I'm gonna walk around the park, kind of take some photos, just stroll, I brought some headphones, so I can listen to some music, and just kind of relax, and just kind of spend the last weekend before Christmas taking photos and relaxing. So I I'm, I'm feel like that when I go out to take photos, most of the time, I don't have an idea in my head of what I want to do, but today I, I kind of did because I just want to relax, and that's like the whole thing. When I take photos of like last week where I'm photographing like the old gas station or the abandoned Kmart and things like that, that's a lot of driving. Everything's kind of spread out here in Hampton Roads. I'm in Chesapeake, Virginia, so everything's kind of spread out. So this way, I can kind of go to one place take photos, kind of relax. It's kind of a pain in the ass to carry this tripod around, but I'm gonna carry the tripod around and uh, just kind of take some photos and relax. So let me go take some photos and I'll show you them. I'm gonna record some little videos and things like that too, try to drop them in. And I'll be back in uh, just a little bit. So see ya. Hiding. Everything in life feels very fun. Hardly 
even snuff But I stay inside like it's the ice age I need you to dry my face Look how I behave And all the mess that I made So those were the photos and the videos that I took. This took a different route than I expected it to take. I thought I was gonna get some um, like gloomier type photos, but this ended up being like a really pretty morning. And I think the color's gonna be brighter by the way I edit them. And I don't know if you saw like a couple videos ago, I walked around in the woods and took some and I like edited them like really dark, really contrasty. And that's what I kind of had in my mind when I came out here this morning was to do the same thing with that kind of style. But I think I'm gonna apply the archetype process like Portra 400 to these might not if they look different that's probably why but that's kind of the mind like the idea i have in mind maybe some more pastels there's some cat tails that i photographed and been videoed and those were so bright and like pretty i'm really hoping they turn out well because this was probably my favorite photos that i took out here and like the car was pretty cool i wish i had a 50 millimeter for that instead of the 35 when you shoot vertical everything kind of gets a little stretched it, it kind of looks normal but it's a little stretched more than the, the 50 obviously but the 50 has a compression of that and like i think like cars and things like that look better shot vertically with that so i, I hope you enjoyed this this is kind of like a real chill thing i'll probably put some music behind this or whatever and um we'll kind of see this is the week before christmas so i probably won't make another video I might make one more this year. We'll see. Um, but I just want to say thanks. Thanks for watching this. If you made it here to the end, you know, I appreciate that. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. This is probably a little different. Like I said, repeat myself, but it's okay. Um, you know, when you have something in mind as like a style or whatever you want to do, sometimes it's nice to deviate from that and spend some time with yourself and try something else. And you know, once you try a bunch of different things, you'll find what you like. People always ask me like, how did they take better photos? Or you know, how do you find your style? Thing like that. I think it just comes from trying different things so many times and you'll, you'll piecemeal things. Maybe you'll do street for a little bit, figure out how you like that. You might shoot cars or portraits or nature or, or whatever. Not that this is nature, this is like the city park. But you know, you, you, you take little pieces from things and you can kind of comprise them together to create your own style after time and that's where your, your, your style is going to come from. It's going to come from your voice and what you see in your eye and things like that in your style, maybe like an editing style a certain way or composing things a certain way. And then over time, you'll, you'll find your own voice and your own style. So when people ask me that, that's kind of like, like it's kind of a cop out to say that, but that's this is truth. You know, after you do it for so long and you try different things, you'll eventually find something that, that, that speaks to you and that you like. And sometimes it's nice to get out of that because you'll find yourself getting in a rut and photographing things. Like the videos last week, the photos, that's like my style. You, you know, flat walls, boring things, and um, composing things a certain way. That's kind of like the style that I like and that's kind of easy for me. So doing this is a little different and a little harder. So, um, but sometimes it's nice. So again, thanks.